intro. Hi there, everybody. I'm Andy, and welcome back to another episode of Lifeless the Abandoned, a custom story for Amnesia the Dark Descent. And uh, if you want to know how I got where I am, watch my first video. <laughs> All right, so here we are. We got out of that dank dungeon thing, and uh, now we're up here. We've got six tenders. We got the oil lamp with just a smidgen of oil. So I'm gonna walk around here. Oh gee, I wonder where I'm supposed to go. Okay, all right. Do do do. I want to know where the the moosehead monster guy went, man. You know, you got to keep an eye on them. Although I figured out in another one of my videos that they, you know, when you're not around. They're, they're not just standing around picking their noses, they're breakdancing. I found that out, so... But a lot of blood on the carpet here. Okay, another tinderbox. A kick cat. And I, I wish his head would stop doing that. Ooh. Looks like we have some drawings here. Rather disturbing looking drawings. We have a mannequin statue. Oh, yay! There's a, another tinder box. I always get all the tinder boxes. Hey, 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 hey. Got some important advice for you. Tricks are for kids. Not the Midnight Man. He doesn't like tricks. I tried that. Anyway, okay, so we're in here. Where over here is. Didn't anyone have hallways in this castle? I guess they all crawled around in, in, in little crawl spaces? It's a, uh oh. Deeper and deeper I go into the depths of the castle, I keep getting that feeling that I'm going to perish, but I don't know the future that I seek. Uh, wouldn't the future that you seek would be like freedom, getting out? And... Oh, apparently the way collapsed behind us. Seriously, was this like the castle of the midget, midget pygmy people or something? The door is locked but looks weak. No, wait, wait. The door is locked but looks weak. Okay, so basically he's saying that I can smash the door open. I'll have to find something to smash it open with. Ooh, more tenders. This guy's really uh, been liberal with the tinder boxes. I appreciate that. Ah! Ooh, <laughs> that kind of broke funny. But hey, at least it broke, right? And it's not my sanity is hurting, but there's not a lot I can do about it. Okay. So like what? Okay. Down we go. And sounds like Josh is doing acrobatics in his room. His school day is finally over with, you know. So. Alright, we'll wait for the next. Come on, hurry up and load. Oh, the ladder must have broken on us. We fell. Alright, get up, dude. Get up. You say you don't know what kind of future you're looking for? How about a future where you live? Oh. Oh, okay, there we go. I didn't want to move there for a minute. Finally, we're out of the the dwarf servant part, whatever the heck that was. Alright, hello, Massey. Hello, Massey. Since he gave us a lot of... Ooh, it's a little dark. I don't want to use so many... Uh, so much of my lantern because I have yet to see any oil. Like I said, he was really liberal with the tinder boxes, so that's good news. I have to look for oil and tinder boxes that are stashed. You never know what you might be finding. No, I meant run. Okay. 
I have to say, I like how he's put the graphics and stuff together. I mean, this is the stuff he's custom made, okay? But still, you know, there's some people that put together some custom stories. They didn't do a really good job actually putting the, the stuff together. The ambience is good. Uh -huh. It's interesting. No, like that again. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> So that would have been a, a little bit of a better jump scare if I w hadn't been kind of expecting it. And what I mean by expecting it is nothing had happened in a while and I, I was just kind of tensing, waiting for something to happen. If I had been goofing around uh, <laughs> like I do normally, that would have been a good scare. Okay, let's start looking here. Alright. Ooh, I see a lock on that cell door up ahead. Ooh, this, this, I'll give them props on the, you know, it looks interesting. And plenty of places to explore. Oh, that door's locked. Okay, um, I'm going to look in here first. Hello? Ooh, the black bird of hungoverness. I don't know, look at the face of that bird. Doesn't he kind of look like he was hungover? Anyway. Okay, moldy bread. Anything in the stove? No, nothing on the stove. Oh, it goes further. Sure. Now, is this looks like a wine cellar or a root cellar or whatever? Oh, a glass jar. I bet we're gonna be mixing something together. Now, is that vine or blood? Let's hope it's vine. Okay, is there, is there anything? Oh yes, we found some stuff. Ooh, more tinder boxes. Table. We'll move you out the way. Okay. Now we can get to it. Landium. Tender box. Tender box. No more oil? Okay. Lots of tender boxes. Look, we're up to seven. And I've already used a bunch. Yeah, but no oil. You know, a little stingy in the oil. Okay. So let's go out here. Somebody or something is screaming off in the distance. Seriously, I heard, ah, ah, like someone being tortured. Just a little bit of light. Okay, so what am I looking for here? Food storage. Okay, well, wasn't that the potato cellar? Yeah. Yeah, I am armed with a shovel. Okay. I, I am. I'm hearing screams. Okay. I don't want to leave this level just yet. Ooh, what's this on the floor? I'm trying to avoid stepping in it. A sulfuric acid mixture. Okay. Oh, no. Finally. One, need a glass jar. Got it. Two, get acid from the acid barrel down in the wine storage, which is located in the food storage. Okay. Need sulfuric acid mixture. This will help you to make it more fluidly and powerful. You need to heat up the acid before experimenting it. I, I got a feeling that English isn't their first language. It it's okay, I we get the general idea. By heating it up, it will make it more efficient and powerful to strong metals. Thanks for reading our instructions. You're faithfully Professor Williams. Okay, so I have other things to go find. A little bit of oh, finding some oil would be nice. Okay, so I guess we're gonna go down here into food storage. Ah, we need to use it on that lock. The other door is a, a short hallway. There's this, uh, a barred door with a, a huge padlock. So what we're doing is we're making something to get that padlock off of it. Wider and weirder and weirder things happen. Um, I'll have to read it later. Wait, wouldn't the food seller go down? This is going kind of uh... Ooh. Why do I feel like that's going to break on me as I start to walk on it? Okay. 
It didn't. Aha! Aha! Ha! Ooh. Something collapsed. Oh! Food storage. Let's see. What we got? We got somebody with a beard. Hello, beard guy. More gas jars. We got rotted pigs. Why do anyone have like you know smoked meats and stuff? Ooh, I love these little bottles. There was yeah, me that me and Josh are working on the Great Works, and there's one that has like a you know this food looks like it's been here for years to rot. Yeah. Actually, if it had been years, dude. Oh look, look, look! It's teeny tiny wardrobes. A key. The, the, they're miniature wardrobes. Isn't that cool? The wine storage key. How about some oil? I want some oil. Dude, oil. There's another tinderbox. I said liberal with the tinderbox is stinky on the oil. The kitchen. Why would you have blocks of iron in, in this part? Ooh. Do I want to know what made that? Ooh. Yeah, this this part don't look too good. This part don't look too good. This looks like some serious junk went down, man. Right here. Ooh, I can't go that way. All right, that's the way we came in here. Yeah, it looks like some serious junk went down here. Here, I'm, I'm going to... I'm gonna clean it up. <laughs> All right, uh, we're already 12 minutes into this. I wondered if Moose Head was gonna come out. What's that? Oh, dead rats. I was thinking maybe the Moosehead guy was going to come out to play. Uh oh. Let's see. Sella Vinare. Let's see. What would what could that possibly mean? Sella Vinare. Uh wine cellar? The vino divine. Okay, let's see. There's a note here. I hit the key. I would like to inform you that I have concealed the key somewhere else. Despite my enemies roaming around this storage, I had to conceal the key quick before they spot me. The key is hidden in the left cabinet in the kitchen. I know, we found it. On the first floor. Once you get the key, you may enjoy yourself in the wine storage. That's where we keep our mixes of all types of liquids. Our best one yet is the acidic mixture. That acid can burn to solid metal. Okay. Interesting. All right, let me back up and pause it here. I have to stop this episode here. I keep my episodes short, so mainly so I can upload them. And because, you know, 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes is about as long as I really want to tie up anyone's time watching a video or not. So, hope you like this episode. Hope you like the videos. Um, if you like the episode, my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? That way you get notifications when I upload something new. Uh, Hope you guys are having a great day where we are out there. Please stay safe and take care of yourself. And I hope to see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.